what is going on guys and girls welcome to the channel this video is going to be a one video series that is going to teach you jira from beginning to advanced this video is specially these videos are especially catered for people who are looking for scrum master product owner or senior scrum master job so if you are someone who is looking for a project manager scrum master or product owner job this video series will teach you how to use Jira on a daily basis or if you are someone who is already working as a product owner or a scrum master watching this video series will make you a stronger person in your role because I will go from beginner to advanced in teaching you how to use Jira on a daily basis and how to use Jira better in your role so that you can give better reports to your stakeholders you can manage your backlog better and that is what we are going to cover in this video series so sit back enjoy and relax because this video is going to teach you everything that you need to know in jira if you are applying for the positions of a scrum master or if you are someone who is already working as a scrum master what we will cover in this video series is what is jira why do scrum masters use jira what are some parallel tools to Jira? Because only 90% of the companies use Jira. 10% of the companies, they use other software tools which are parallel to Jira but are not Jira. What will this course cover? How to create an account in Jira. Okay, how to create a user story. We will also show you proper way to write a user story in Jira. Okay, how to create Apex, how to create and start a sprint, how to manage and prioritize a backlog, how to manage and track dependencies, blockers in Jira, how to create sprint reports and velocity reports for the stakeholders and the senior management team, how to create uh, track and create sprint burn down charts, how to run a daily standup using Jira. So these are the things that we will learn in this course. Uh, if you are a scrum master or person who wants to become a scrum Scrum master or if you are a product owner or if, who wants to become a product owner this course is for you okay this course will teach you everything from beginner level to the advanced level that advanced people use on a daily basis okay now if you are someone who is just here learning about Jira on a general basis, you don't want to use it in your role or you are uh, someone who just wants to get knowledge, this video might not be the right fit for you because this video is very specifically catered for people who are wanting to become Scrum Masters or Product Owners or who are already working as Scrum Masters or Product Owners. So if you are someone who is just learning Jira and playing around, this might not be the right video for you because it is very specifically catered for a certain segment of people. Okay, so those are the things that we are going to learn in this video series okay today is the first uh, introduction video in this video we are going to go over what is jira and why do scrum masters use jira so these are the two questions we are going to cover today and what i'm going to do is i'm also going to show you how to log in into jira and how to create an account into jira so if you are someone who is not uh, working for a company right now or even if you are working for a company uh, jira is free to use for for one or two people jira is free to use even up to five people i think jira is free to use so go ahead um, go to jira click right jira the first link will pop up or this link will pop up click on that link uh, click on get it free okay once you click on get it free uh, you go next and you create over here my account is already created so uh, i'm already able to do it but you can say uh, create an account once you create an account you will be able to log in once you log in you will end up at this uh, screen right here which is the home screen okay and uh, from here um, we will uh, start with the first video and I will show you how to uh, create a project and how to go about everything. So go ahead and log in, create an account and once you have created an account, um, we will move on to the next step. Now, while you're creating an account and doing all that, uh, it's a free account, you don't have to pay for anything. So what is Jira? Let's answer this question, okay? So what Jira is, it is a project management tool. It is a project management tool where the teams have their work uh, that is picked out from the backlog and that work is put into particular sprints and that work is being worked on right now. And to track that work, the project managers and the scrum masters and the product owners, they use Jira okay to track the work to track the progress on the work to communicate with other teams to communicate with each other through comments to communicate with each other through dependencies blockers to communicate with management through reports that is what jira is used for so again what is jira jira is a tool 
that project managers, scrum masters, product owners, and the development teams, they use to manage their work, to track their work, to communicate with each other, to communicate with stakeholders, to communicate with different teams, through reports, through comments, through dependencies, through blockers, okay? That is what is Jira. Why do Scrum Masters use Jira? Scrum Masters use Jira to track the progress of their project. So let's say uh, we started a sprint um, uh, this week. So whatever items are in the sprint, uh, you know, earlier they used to use Excel, but now we have Jira. In, in a, on a Jira board, we can see what is in progress, what is going on right now, uh, what is, you know, uh, what is at in to do what is blocked and what is done as you can see on my screen this is what a daily scrum board looks like and we will get into how to create a daily scrum board or, or, or all that but a scrum master basically uses jira to track the work that is being done in the current sprint and how he will track is is through the daily scrum board and also, a Scrum Master also uses Jira to track dependencies and blo uh, blockers associated with every task and make sure the impediments are resolved. Also, a Scrum Master also uses Jira to communicate with the stakeholders through reports, uh, through velocity, through sprint burndown charts, through project tracking, those kind of things. So basically, a Jira board is the bread and butter of a Scrum Master or a project manager or a product owner okay and the development team also so this tool is very very powerful tool very very useful tool and if you know this tool well you can do great as a scrum master no matter what which company you apply for no matter how high of a position you apply for as long as you know jira you can work as an enterprise coach from a scrum master okay you can do whatever this is a very powerful tool and it's very simple to learn and we will go step by step and learn every little thing about this that you can use on a daily basis okay so again what we will do first step is for the for the first video all you have to do is go ahead log in create an account into jira it's free to do okay once you log in you will end up on this screen okay you will end up on you will end up on this screen once you are on this screen uh, we will move on to the next video in the next video we will show you how to create a project you know how to create a sprint and how to create backlogs apex user stories all that good stuff but for now go ahead log in into jira create an account once you have created an account um, you know get an understanding of what is jira jira is a project management tool used by scrum master product owners to communicate with each other to track the progress of the project to track the progress of the sprint to communicate with stakeholders and management through reports okay and why do scrum masters use jira scrum masters use jira because they want to track the progress of the sprint they want to make sure the dependencies are resolved they want to make sure that the developers are communicating with each other through comments and uh, you know uh, they are, they want to make sure that they are tracking velocity with the sprint reports and they want to make sure that the sprint burn down chart is looking good but the work is getting done properly uh, there is no scope creep and things like that which we will go deeper into the further videos okay so that is it for the first part of this video but in the next videos we are going to cover what are some parallel tools to jira and we will cover these first three how to create epics how to create user stories and how to create an account in jira okay so for this video that is it guys thank you so much for watching get ready get your account signed up and i will see you in the next tutorial Bye bye